Hello beautiful family, when life throws lemons at you, indeed it's in your best interest to make lemonades out of them. Yes, I'm glad to have you guys here today and this is still Biggest Baby TV. Please don't forget to like, share, comment, subscribe if you've not and then turn on your post notification bell. Fam, I trust you guys are having a beautiful, beautiful day and I trust you're staying safe and you know, showing love to everyone around you. Fam, we are still on this very serious discussion of Licorose's re um, return or visit to where she grew up. This girl, as you know, was born in the ghetto and she grew up in the ghetto, man. But the ghetto had nothing on her because she's grown past it and then she's here to support people. But very most importantly, we are coming from another angle. Very recently, she put out a post, a very inspiratory post. I have not seen Licorose inspire people the way she has done in the past few days. Licorose told fans about where she grew up. In my opinion, it takes a lot of humility and sincerity to be very open about how you grew up. I mean, some people like to paint these things, they like to cover these things, but it's not for a girl like Clickoros. She has always been very plain, not trying to funerize or like claim what she's not, regardless of the fact that she was a superstar before she became really, really popular. She was big on TikTok. However, she has not hidden the fact that she grew up from a very, you know, not privileged home. For most people who grew up in under such circumstances, you will agree with me that there are not so many opportunities for such people. Yes, fam, the sky is wild enough, I'll be large enough for people to fly. But the truth is that you know sometimes your angle of elevation where you're placed doesn't give you all the opportunity you need to fly and be what you have to. But you just have to fight, you just have to push, you just have to keep nudging on. And that is what Likoros told the fans recently. Yeah, on this very inspiring post. Likoros recalled when she used to like walk on the streets with the go-getter mindset and not necessarily having anything in view like nothing to like you know lay hold on and say I've done or I've achieved yet she kept on you know pushing for herself this is very relatable most African young ladies can relate to this story trust me fam and I'm sure a lot of you understand what I'm saying so she was just talking about how she has now grown into what you know had been planned for her by God and how grateful she is to see that those her dreams never died you know this girl kept on supporting herself right from when she was a dancer going to places like the island for those who live in Lagos you know that there's a definition that like there's like a division between the rich and the poor specifically we're talking about the Lagos and then the Lagos island she used to go to Lagos island to rehearse her dance steps and all of that you know but right now Licorose is big and she lives on the island that is so amazing you know very recently Licorose visited that same hood and walked on the streets but this time around she went with her security detail and she had a camera guy they were doing a coverage and she was pointing to areas she used to go when she was still very unpopular when she was still poor and that was necessitated this post indeed i believe and i pray that each and every one of us will get to a point where we'll go we'll have to look back and say this is where i used to stay as i when i wasn't doing so well this was where i used to be this is how i used to do and one thing that remained constant and licorice talked about it and that's what i want to happen was her go-getter spirit and i want to encourage everybody this is the beginning of the year fam you're a go-getter set goals and i believe that god will make them you could make it make it possible for you to achieve those goals indeed lee Coros has been an inspiration to a lot of people over the past three days she has been inspiring people this same year she bought a car as at this time last year she said she was financially unstable she was looking for money to get stuff for her family to set her family up but right now this girl is big on all fronts like internationally and this is my prayer i believe some of us will grow past the levels we are in and tomorrow or later in the future when we look back we'll be like wow thank god for not taking me this far i think this is very personal because most of us as africans have stories that are very similar to this so please keep pushing and i really celebrate you know the chorus is work ethic the girl is hard working she has not rested since she left the big brother niger house she's a go-getter she keeps dancing with her crew yes with the god the girls got better crew she keeps traveling from one country to the other she keeps you know appearing as a host on different shows and the truth is that she has not done this by her strength it's simply that she is a child of grace there's so many other adam housemates who came out who have the you know the capabilities who actually come from wealthier homes but how come she's doing better than them i'm not saying this to spite them or slight them but this is the truth indeed licorice is a child of grace and it's nothing anyone can say to that or to remove that fact and i'm really really proud of her she understands that her strength couldn't have taken her that far and that's why she's always grateful to god and her fans who you know who have bent over backwards to see that she 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 gets support from them who literally give her all that she needs who celebrate her little achievements indeed 
greatest achievement for any person that has lived in the slums is to come out of the slums and be an inspiration to people that are in the slums because those people now see you as the beacon of light and like oh if this person can reach there then i too can this is still biggest baby tv please don't forget to like share comment subscribe and turn on the post notification yeah we have a big announcement coming up please keep your fingers crossed god bless